Hello everyone, my name is Michalis Lazaru and I am presenting our work named Adaptive Manifold for Imbalanced Transductive Fusion Learning. This work was a collaborative effort between researchers from Imperial College London and the Institute of Advanced Research in Artificial Intelligence in Vienna. My fellow co-authors are Yanis Avrithis and Tanya Stathagi. What is Future Learning? Future Learning investigates how to enable deep learning models to solve novel tasks when the available data is limited. It is very important because abundance of data is not always available. Human labor required to obtain and annotate data is expensive, and it is very time inefficient to obtain and annotate large data sets. Multiple different research directions have been proposed to tackle the future learning problem, such as meta-learning, transfer learning, feature adaptation, and data augmentation. Another line of research that investigates future learning is that of exploiting unlabeled data. Unlabeled data can be easily obtained at a much lower cost since no human labor is required for annotating the data, making this line of research very attractive. Various ideas have been proposed on how to utilize the unlabeled data in future learning effectively, such as by exploiting the underlying manifold of the labeled and unlabeled data through label propagation or embedding propagation, by iteratively pseudo-labeling the unlabeled data before selecting the most confident pseudo-labels, and by using the unlabeled data for class central refinement. In our work, we investigate the transductive future learning setting where label support examples and unlabeled queries are all available at test time. Transactive fusion learning benchmarks use perfectly class balanced tasks. However, it has been identified that several methods exploit this bias by encouraging class balance predictions. Common class balancing techniques include using the Synchronov algorithm and maximizing the entropy of the marginal distribution of the predicted labels over queries. To address this limitation, a new imbalanced transactive future learning benchmark has been proposed. The main lines of research in transactive future learning include class centroid approaches and data manifold approaches. Class centroid approaches are iteratively refined class centroids using unlabeled data. Data manifold approaches exploit the underlying manifold to make predictions of the unlabeled data. Our contributions include, we propose a novel algorithm that combines the merits of both class centroid and data manifold approaches named Adaptive Manifold, AM. We achieve new state-of-the-art performance in the imbalanced transductive fusion learning. Our method can perform on par or even outperform many state-of-the-art methods in the standard balanced transductive fusion learning. Regarding the problem formulation and definitions, for the pre-training stage, we use publicly available pre-trained networks from published works. The network F-theta is trained on D-base, which is a dataset where every image Xi has a corresponding label Yi from C-base. At the inference stage, we assume access to a novel class dataset D-novel with C-novel disjoint from C-base. We also assume access to the pre-trained F theta, a support set S, and a query set Q. Additionally, we focus on imbalanced transductive fusion learning, where all examples from S and Q are available at inference at the same time, and the number of unlabeled queries per class is different. Moving on to our method, we start by embedding the support set and query set examples using the pre-trained backbone F theta. We obtain feature embeddings and using the label support embeddings of every class, we calculate the class centroid of every class. We follow this by constructing a k nearest neighbor graph before we carry out label propagation to obtain class predictions for all query examples. We iteratively adapt the manifold class centroids along with manifold specific parameters in order to obtain the best possible manifold to make predictions for the query examples. We adapt the manifold in two different ways. If we have prior knowledge that the task at hand is class balanced, we minimize the loss function proposed by the paper team in Europe 2020. 
where the first term minimizes the standard cross entropy loss, the second term minimizes the entropy of the queries, and the last term maximizes the entropy of the average predicted probability distribution of the query set. Regarding the imbalance setting, we follow the paper Alpha Team from NeurIPS 2020R and minimize the relaxed version of the loss function that can tolerate more effectively class distribution variations. Lastly, we we'll use the final manifold to make predictions for every query by classifying every query to the class with the highest manifold similarity. We can see the effectiveness of every module in the ablation study. Using KNRS neighbor graph, adapting manifold centroids, adapting manifold parameters, and using PLC preprocessing all have positive effect in the performance of our method. Regarding the comparisons with the state of the art in the imbalanced fusion learning, we can see that our method achieves a new state of the art by more than 3.5% in the one shot setting and 0.5% in the five shot setting using the ResNet 18 backbone. We also achieve similar results when using the WRN 2810 backbone network, showing that our method is robust with different datasets and backbone networks. Additionally, our method outperforms origin par with several state-of-the-art methods in the balanced transactive few short learning setting. Lastly, we show that our method can outperform significantly alpha team in the presence of more unlabeled data, verifying that our hypothesis that using manifold similarity to calculate class centroids is superior to using Euclidean distance. Reaching the conclusion of my presentation, I would like to emphasize emphasize that in this work, we propose a novel algorithm that can be curated to class balanced and imbalanced tasks accordingly. We achieve substantial improvement in the state-of-the-art performance in the imbalance setting. We perform on par or outperform other state-of-the-art methods in the balance setting. Regarding future directions, we are interested in applying our algorithm in other settings beyond future learning. Also, we are interested in applying the algorithm in real-world applications. Thank you. If you have any information, please refer to our paper and do not hesitate to contact us directly.